Oh my god, how is it this hot? This English man is asking how it's this hot, ladies and gentlemen. He's asking. Oh. Well, if I didn't have a laptop on recording software and an Xbox and a TV on, it'd be much of a dumbass, really, because it's going to be hot, but this is unprecedented. It's wacky workbench. It's the fifth level. Shit's getting wacky. Shit's getting groovy. And we got these launch pads on the floor. Oh my lord, I thought those were going to crush me. One thing that I've not mentioned, and I'm, I'm sorry guys, it, it is a criticism yet again. I, I'm not wanting to keep shitting on this game for no reason, but... Oh my god, that is an epilepsy thing. What the hell? What? What is going on? What? Guys, what's going on? That effect is actually hurting my eyes. I might have to put an epilepsy one in this video. I'm, I'm being serious. Like, what is that? There are many levels in this game where the levels are very vertical instead of left to right. And some people might say that's a good thing and they prefer that. I don't. I think, just like I said before, sometimes you can play this game and because you've never played that particular level in the past or the future. Oh my god. You've not experienced all that level has to offer. But I think I've somehow missed a lot of the verticality of this game in the midst of this let's play so far. But this level is very vertical and I don't like it. All these launch pads on the ground. <laughs> Look at those microphones. Man. Just realised that that was in Studiopolis and Sonic Mania. I think there's a decent amount of Sonic CD in Sonic Mania. More than it deserved, really, in my opinion. I don't think this game deserved to be in Sonic Mania as much as it was. Not one of the best soundtracks in the game, but still serviceable. I'm going to die here, I think. Or not. Right, so again, where am I meant to go? I keep going into the same place. How do I avoid that? Okay, there we go. There's the goal. Not thrilling level design. Look at the colour palette. Just look at that colour palette, man. I think, you know, I compared this to Resi Code Veronica before. I think when the main team were making Resident Evil 3, which is a masterpiece, they were making Code Veronica. And I think they were making Sonic 2 at the same time as this game. I mean, enough said, ladies and gentlemen. Enough said with both games as to why they are the way they are. And of course, when you play a game as a let's play, you know, I'm, I, I love this series so much. So when I criticise, I do it because I want it to be better and I see the flaws that are within this game, but I'm not just shitting on it for no reason here. But you've got to understand when you do a let's play of a certain game, you might... God, why does he keep going left when I don't want him to? You might get people on the video who aren't happy or very salty again, but... It comes from a good place, ladies and gentlemen. I just wish I liked this game more. I oh! Okay. I think I've died, like, more times than I have in all my other Sonic... Let's play so far, right? By the way, I did say at the start of this Let's Play that I may one day, it's not a promise, but I may one day do Sonic 3D Blast on the channel. And I hope you're ready for a hot take, ladies and gentlemen. Because Sonic CD Blast is a much better game than this. Sonic CD Blast is pretty damn good. Oh, and I've got another surprise for you. 
Its soundtrack is freaking amazing. What is frustrating about these is I can't remember what levels. I think it is it Carnival Night Zone. There's something like this. But it goes so slow that you always know which side you're going to go to, whether it's the left or the right. Though, if I mean to go right, I'll end up going left. If I mean to go left, I'll end up going right. Is it my fault? Sometimes. But not always, because it's that damn fast, you lose track of which way you're meant to go. Oh my lord. What a wonderful colour palette. This level certainly does, in its name and its audio and everything else, have quite an industrial feel. Yet again, another vertical level. Um, I like platformers that go from left to right. You know where you're, where you're up to. I don't like platformers where it's quite simply the opposite. I don't like Metroidvania. That can't be... Oh my god, how short! Oh shit, I remember this. Vaguely. Crusher at the top, is it? Oh my lord. Do I stay in the middle? I think I do. Bro, fuck me, you fat bastard. Oh, what the... How's that for? I'm not meant to hit him, right? Robotnik's gonna uptown funk you up, ladies and gentlemen. This game's gonna funk you up. What the hell am I meant to do there again? We're meant to do that. Is that it? I've got a puzzled look on my face right now, ladies and gentlemen. It could only be Sonic CD. Woo! That rhymed. I was not anticipating these levels being so quick but it's stardust speedway and i've got another hot take for you this game is seen as one of the best levels on sonic cd honestly i don't think it is i think this is where we uh, face off with that metal sonic is it as well douchebag sonic i don't like this level as much as other people do but that's right you're damn right ladies and gentlemen thanks for saying that the music's amazing see you in the next one